Hello everyone, today we are looking buckling analyzer for columns. Analytical and FM calculation with prepo max. In 1757, mathematician Leonard Euler derived a formula for critical axial force in a column. It is maximum axial load that a long ideal column can carry without buckling. An ideal column is one that is perfectly straight, homogeneous and free from initial stress. To first, Euler length factor OK, the value depends on the conditions of end support of the column. Here you can see cases with different boundary conditions. Euler formula for critical force is formula 1 with pi, elastic modulus, moment of inertia, length factor and length of column. We can calculate one analytical example, column with dimension, dimension wide and height 2 mm, length 100 mm and elastic modulus 210,000 MPa. Calculate moment of inertia is 1.333 mm. With formula 1, for case 1, we have a critical force 69.1 Newton. We calculate the case 2, 3 and 4. Here you can see results for all cases. Now we can simulate this example in PrepoMax. Start PrepoMax, new project. Import column geometry. To first mesh the geometry, hexaedra elements. with element sides 1 mm first order extrude mesh parameter frontal delaunay for quads and recombine algorithm glosso number of elements 100 Create mesh Important to use C dry D8 I elements in this case Two reference points for boundary conditions. Create material, elastic steel with A modulus and portion ratio. After this, create solid section. Rigid constraints between top and bottom surface to reference points. And now to step buckling. One mode, first buckling mode. Boundary conditions for case 1. Bottom end is fixed and upper side of column is free. Create a nominal force 1 Newton. Results we get a buckling factor from FAM, and in case that the force is equal to 1 Newton, the factor is the same to critical force. Run analysis. Results. Here you can see deformation and buckling factor. 
buckling factor multiplying with force. Here is a nominal force by Newton. The critical force for case 1 is 68.195 Newton. Go back to model, change boundary conditions. For case 2, both ends of columns are pinned, free rotation about x axis. Run simulation again. Result critical force for case 2 is 217.4 Newton. In the same way, we calculate the case 3 and 4. Here are results summary from case 1 to 4. It was for today. See you next time. Bye bye.